Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I just wanted to quickly jump on here while you know the sun was out. It is a Friday afternoon. I've just finished work so excuse obviously the appearance and I don't want to sort of be too loud because my roommate is sleeping so we'll see how this goes but I just wanted to show you guys a few of the things that I picked up from ASOS and also bought online. So here we go. I might start off with the ASOS haul first because it's basically already out. One of the first things I want to show you are actually these earrings and if you can see from behind me I actually purchased quite a few earrings and chokers so I will start start off with those and um, these ones are actually from River Island it's like a hoop or a circle with a pearl inside so really pretty really cute and they're just really simple studs which I think is so work appropriate and just like really dainty and pretty and it's sort of like a different take on the classic hoop so that is that um, and then I bought a few other things that I thought I would share with you guys. I bought some more hoops so as you can see there um, these are quite a lot larger and it'd be pretty cool to wear them right now actually I might change what if I changed up that'd be cool. Oh they are heavy though so that's sort of one thing I would caution you. I sort of went crazy on the ASOS haul, um, ASOS sale there was like 20% off of everything and yeah I kind of went crazy so those are that, so pretty cool, might keep them on. So that's the first thing and it comes in a pack of two and there's another sort of smaller version there, I don't know if you can see, um, yeah there's a twisted version and then these small ones so really cool two in one pack. And then what else did I get? I also got just some silver hair really plain. I also got these, this really cool like necklace um, choker um, and then you sort of wear it like this. This is not the right top to be wearing chokers but this is what it looks like. So I thought this was really cool. This one I'm definitely going to keep um, because it's just really trendy with like obviously the circular detail. This shape is just really in at the moment. You see it in belt, you see it in bag details, you see it in hoops. So yeah, it's really cool. Um, I did also purchase this um, choker. It's like felt love heart. So if I do this... This is what it looks like. It's just a really cool um, take on like the tattoo chokers that you see around all the time. But it's love heart. So that's really cool. I'm thinking about this one. Don't know if I'm going to return it yet. Got a few more accessories. The next one. Also got some gold leaf. Yeah, this is what they look like. So I don't know if I'm going to keep these, I've just left them as it is because once you open it you can't actually return it. But I'm, I think I'm probably going to return it because I bought a little bit too many pairs of earrings. And then the last pair of earrings that I, or the last thing that I bought is actually this big chainmail choker. It's pretty cool actually, I'll show you. But I'm thinking of returning this one just because it's a little bit too blingy for me so if you have a look this is what it looks like I mean, it's pretty cool I might see how I can style this because it would look really cool with like band shirts and then a blazer instead of you know your classic black choker so we'll see I'm not sure about this. I do love chokers. They're really, really cool and trendy. Now, moving on to the next bit of accessories I want to share with you are these gold sandals. They are gorgeous. I love myself a great pair of gold heels, gold shoes, just because they're such a neutral. Everyone needs a black pair of heels and a gold pair of heels and silver, to be honest, and nude. Those are honestly the three colors everybody needs in their like, like wardrobe. You can wear this with anything that has a gold accent or even if you're not wearing like accessories, wearing this with any colour honestly as long as it sort of works well with gold, it looks so good and these have like the two strap detail at the front and at the, at the ankle. Um, I got it in a size, I think a size 36 and it fits perfectly and they're super super comfy I and I love the square toe detail 
um, and I do already have a gold pair of heels and I wear them all the time so I thought I'd get myself you know a much modern version um, so yeah I love these these are certainly not going back and I'm so happy to stumble upon them the next piece of clothing I wanted to share with you are these pants these are actually black flared jeans i have been on the lookout for the perfect pair of black flared jeans in forever i think you know this turtleneck this black flared jeans would look awesome bright red lip gold hoops and then you know whatever it would look so effortless it would look so chic i think flares are making such a comeback and hoops like it's all 70s right now and i just love it i love i just love that era um I just think flares actually look really, really good on petite frames, especially when worn with heels. So go and get yourself a pair of nice flares um, and yeah, just rock it. And I got this in a size 24 in a length 30, which is the smallest in the shortest. So um, yeah, and this is just in the regular, regular section. If they had the petite version, I would have jumped on that so quickly. But yeah. They are a tad long, but what I might do is I might cut them or take them in. But yeah, I love these and these are not going back. Excited to wear them. The next thing I thought I'd share with you guys is this skirt. Um, it's just a washed black denim. Oh, well, it's a washed grey denim skirt, mini skirt. Um, another ode to the 90s and I love it because, you know, <laughs> who didn't love the 90s? Again, this with this top, perfect simple minimal and i just absolutely love it and then maybe like a crossbody bag with um with, what are we gonna wear with maybe birkenstocks even yeah super cool love it i reckon you could even wear this in autumn just wear leggings and then like a thicker coat or not leggings and just wear like a longer coat with it super cool next is this linen navy jacket pretty cool and um, it's nice and long so I think you could wear it with that skirt that I showed you and even this top that would look trendy um, I like this but I'm not sure if I really need it I might see how to wear this because and see if I have something similar what I really love about it is the double breasted design I love 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 that sort of like I love that opening on a blazer on a coat it just looks more classic and I just really like it so I'll think about this one but yeah we'll see one of the pieces that we'll be going back though is actually this blazer just because it is so so long I bought it to go with a sort of suit a short suit um, and I really like the shorts they fit really well this is a little bit too long and I have something quite similar so I'm gonna have to I think I'm going to return this one. It's pretty much your standard blazer and it's just got um, ruching on the side. So, you know, that's convenient, especially if you're the type to sort of roll up your sleeves, which I do all the time. So, but this is just going to go back because I have something already very similar and I just feel like it's a little bit too long for me anyways. And honestly, I think that's it. That's everything that I got from ASOS. Now I'm going to move on to, I think this is Ego Shoes. So bear with me. This is actually going to be my second time purchasing from Ego Shoes because the first time they sent me stuff, I just did not like any of them. And the one thing that I did like was completely damaged. So I'm a little bit disappointed with them, but they're the only website that I saw these sort of fur loafers going for a pretty decent price. So we'll see. Ooh, these ones I'm excited about. They have like that really like plasticky smell to them. Okay, so this is the first one that I'm picking out. So they are these. So they're the studded flats. Oh my gosh, they run so big. Like I got this in a three and it's still gigantic. <laughs> but they're cool. I don't know, I'm going to have to try and make it work because I can't afford to actually ship them back. It's cheaper to just purchase new ones and try and get another one shipped. So, yeah. These ones are cool. Excited about these. Next one. Oh. The smell, guys, it's really bad. Alright, so the next pair of shoes are these pink loafers. These are really comfy, but I just don't know about the colour of the pink 
They're like a peachy pink. But they're super comfy. So these are promising. I'm excited. These are the next pair of shoes. I've got black ones. And then on this, the, the um, buckle is a little bit different compared to this, which I wasn't sure about. I actually prefer this style bucket uh, buckle because obviously it looks so much more like the Gucci loafers so if you can see they are different they used to have buckles more similar to this but they recently changed it and these look cool oh I love these these are oh I love them these are good I'm excited about these fluffy loafers and the reason why like the only reason I picked Ego Ego shoes are because of these. Um, you know, if you purchase them anywhere else, they're quite expensive. And I actually did purchase a silver pair, or a, a pair quite similar, and just plain black with silver from Tony Bianco. And I paid like a hundred, or well, original retails like 160. And for all four heels, I paid 160. So this was like just a, this was a fraction of the price, and it fits really nice. So. You know, you really can't go wrong, especially if you just want to try out the trend. And the snake, embroidered snake on this is actually really, really nice. Doesn't look cheap at all. Oh, I'm excited about that one. And then the last one that I got are actually these loafers. All loafers, yes, because I'm obsessed. Oh, I don't like these. This I do not like. This is a little bit too big. Should have sized down. Ah, I'm not happy about these two, so I might send them back. We will see. But yeah, that is it. That's what I got. And then I thought I'd show you guys what is inside here. This is actually from Rye, and they've recently started a makeup store on their website. I think they sent me some stuff to test out. Ah, look at this, guys. We are excited to share MUA shop. Please find any clothes just a sample of what you can expect. It looks like they're getting some stuff from Sigma. Ooh, Napoleon Purtis. Got some Muraness stuff. Got some stuff from Garbo and Kelly. I'm not familiar with this brand. Ooh, these look awesome. These look good. <gasps> oh my gosh. Highlighters. <gasps> I'm so excited. I haven't gotten into makeup in such a long time, you guys, and this is going to be the perfect thing that I need to get me back into it. <gasps> I'm pretty excited. Um, I will touch back with you guys. I might do a separate video on what's in my PO box or what blogger mail video. Um, but I might just leave it here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I hope it turns out. If you did enjoy it or if you want any of the items that I did show, check out the info box. I'm going to put all of the links in the info bar below. In um, you know, all of these items were purchased online, so I should have no trouble linking them all for you guys. Um, and as always, if you do want to see me, you know, styling any of these items, the shoes, you know, the accessories, the clothes. Check out my blog on my Instagram. That's where I post a lot of outfit photos, um, especially ones that don't really make it here on YouTube. So yeah, go and check it out and go and follow me there. I would really, really appreciate it. But if this is the first time to my channel, please go ahead and subscribe. If you know you like these type of videos and you want to be notified of any new videos, you just gotta hit that notification bell. Hope you guys are having a wonderful week or weekend and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.